what's up guys welcome again to another video on adobe illustrator it's me arjun today i'm gonna show how to design vector based computer monitor in adobe illustrator before starting i would request you to subscribe my channel and hit bell icon to get notification for coming video okay let's get started as you know vector graphic is amazing the more you increase its size it doesn't lose its quality well i have a blank document open here now select rectangle tool and draw apply fill color to black either from swatches you can go to window swatches this one or we can use color option as well to black make duplicate copy ctrl c ctrl v of the same rectangle and decrease its size little bit yes and this side little bit more yes which gonna fit inside here then fill color to white this fill color to white select the rectangle this rectangle use direct selection tool make sure all corner points are selected to change its corner radius from this little icon inside like this yes select a rectangle tool again and design one shape like this at the center yes and line color it means stroke color to white and fill color to black the stroke need to increase the size of stroke and select direct selection tool and let's select only the bottom one and change the radius need to send to back just right click on it orange send to black back or from the object you can use arrange this option as well make sure you have enable the smart guide it means from the view smart guide that helps you to center the object between others then select ellipse tool and create little ellipse for the monitor base and apply fill color to black fill color to black and the stroke it doesn't matter you can apply or you can leave it as it is and send to back send to back let me move a little bit to the top okay why don't we design the text as well Mm, okay guys i remember the logo of dell let's design quickly without wasting our time select type tool then d space 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 l l one letter here at the center okay d space l l and again another text layer to e because we need to rotate this 
little bit like this and here okay select both of them object group or and change the fill color to white and place here it's a little bit bigger let me decrease its size holding shift button someone is calling me guys I don't want to disturb you guys okay Dale here all right mm -hmm. now different layer we need to group all together before that why don't we place one image here let me get the screenshot from here this whole screenshot yes this image and place there file place this screenshot place mm -hmm. this one too here if you think the width is a little bit bigger than this you can decrease this way and make sure to put at the center both of them yes and let me place this one here yes this one little bit like this okay and let's group together all of the content all of those objects to group yes now it's ready to use you can decrease its size at a time or increase its size at a time and change the color as well hope guys this is useful for you if you have any comment or question please drop on the comment box below i will answer as soon as possible and if you haven't already please subscribe my channel hit like and bell icon below that encourages me to create more video on coming future wait wait friend don't forget to share with your friend as well thank you bye bye